Welcome back to College Hill Farm. This is Homestead Quickie number 50. Now, inevitably, when I want to use my compressor, uh, a lot of people have a switch that they can just turn it on, and they turn the compressor on, they go use it, and then they come back and turn it off. Well, inevitably, I forget. I do it all the time. I forget and we'll leave the compressor on. I burn a compressor up doing that. So, because, you know, they leak off a little bit and they have to run. They leak off a little bit and have to run. And, and I'm not out here at the shop as much in the summertime so or in the wintertime either one. And I don't see hear it going on and off. So what I did was, and it's one of the best things I ever did, was I set up a timer on my compressor. It's just a little round timer. I bought these. It times for a half an hour is all it times for. You can set it for 15 minutes, you can set it for 10 minutes, you can set it for whatever time you need to uh, blow up your, uh, whatever you're blowing up. I got to blow up a tractor tire this morning. One of my right front tires is getting a little low. It only has about 10 PSI in it, but I've got to blow it up. Well, if I turn this on, it'll be too loud for me to talk, but uh, it will turn on, run for 15 minutes, and if I forget to turn it off, it'll turn itself off. Okay, all blowed up. Now I can just hang my thing back up and go on about my business. And in 10 minutes, that compressor will shut off. Okay, that's Homestead Quickie number 50.